DC fandom gave us a little preview on what's up with Young Justice Season 4. Let's break down Greg Wiseman's Q&A. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to Comic Book Nostalgia. I'm CB Nostalgia and we got a minor update on Young Justice. But first, we wanted to remind everybody, if you're looking for your place for all your comic book news, rumors, and reviews, all while looking for the best and positive in all those characters we love, make sure you hit that subscribe button and ring that bell. Well, DC Fandom was a big hit, and the only point of contention really was the splitting of the conference. About half the presentation panels have been moved to September the 12th, and one of those was Young Justice. Now, I gotta say as a fan, I found that mm, a bit disappointing, but at least we know we're going to get an update. Greg Wiseman and crew actually did release a little preview of the upcoming event on Young Justice vids over here on YouTube. And although we didn't get a ton of information, he does let us know what the status of the show is. Now, the last real update we had was February. We found out 11 scripts were finished, 6 episodes were recorded, but none of the animation was complete. Then COVID struck and everything got tossed up in the air. Now, we won't find out everything until September the 12th, but Wiseman did give us a few details. He did let us know that everybody was working from home. And that's about the best news possible. And all of production and the design work was all being done from home. The other thing being done from home was voice recording, which apparently is a challenge. Typically, the crew gets everybody together in the same room, which I'm sure is great for energy, but now everybody is having to record their individual parts from home. Danica McKellar, who actually plays Miss Martian on the show, did in for just a second and made a little joke about having to record inside her kids' bunk beds. Now, once the panel airs on September 12th, I'm pretty sure we're going to get a trailer and a full update on Season 4. It appears Season 4 is headed over to HBO Max, which really shouldn't surprise anyone. But the real question now is, when? I really don't think anybody was expecting to see the show until next year, so I'm really not that sure how far behind schedule it really is. But as a fan, I have to admit, I'm pretty anxious. We don't really have any plot details for Season 4 yet either, but we do know it's called Phantoms. This has pretty much led everybody to believe it's about ghosts from their past. This makes everybody think Wally West. But let's not forget about Jason Todd, who made an appearance in Season 3. Well, they hinted at Jason Todd in Season 3. In any case, many of the characters have something in their past, a sort of phantom, that could rise up and cause some problems for them, so it could go anywhere. Once we get the full DC fandom panel on Young Justice in about two weeks, we'll bring all the details your way immediately. But I'm really curious on what you guys think. Do you believe production quality can be maintained in that at-home environment? And do you think recording everybody in the same room together provides for a better dynamic between actors? Sound off in the comments below. If you like this video, make sure you press like, click subscribe, and if you don't ring that bell, you won't get any updates. Peace.